giving me bad vibes. It's giving me that I have my money vibes, okay? Moolala, yeah, yeah. <laughs> For today's video, I am going to be trying out this eyeshadow palette from Fenty Beauty that I picked up in the color scheme 10 Money. Honestly, when these snap shadows came out, I wasn't really like, I didn't really care to buy them because it's $25 and it's pretty small. It's only six colors and I just felt like I could get something better. So, and the colors that they had to begin with, I didn't really care for necessarily. But I saw Alyssa Ashley use this particular palette and I was like, wow, I love this. I love these colors. I have to have it. Oh my God, that's so cute. Wait, this might be my thumbnail right here. I like that. So cute. <laughs> um, but the colors are really stunning. I'm really into greens these days. I love greens. So when I saw Alyssa Ashley's video, I was like, yeah, I have to get this. And the colors are named Fat Pockets, Need Receipts, Time is Money, Rubber Bands, Direct Deposit, and Flash Money. And I always love Rihanna's play on words when she's naming her products. So since this one is Ten Money, all the colors are like money related, you know? So that's pretty clever and unique. I also picked up four of the Fly Pencils. I have, um, I think this one was Cherry Punk. You can see the color down at the bottom. Bad Bride, see about it. And the one that I'm gonna use today is Bank Tank. And these I ordered off of Fenty Beauty's website and they were having 30% off. So um, I think usually they were like $22 if I'm not mistaken and I got these for 15. So yeah, I picked up four and the eyeshadow palette i got it off of sephora and it was 25 dollars, like i mentioned before okay just throwing it out there i'm not that great at makeup i'm just testing these things out so this is not going to be a tutorial this is just going to be my first impression on this eyeshadow palette and the um fly pencil so i am going to put on primer and i have the fenty beauty true matte pro filter i really love this primer it feels really really good on my skin i would literally just walk out the house with this as a moisturizer like that's how good it feels honestly and i have been using fenty skin to wash my face twice a day and like do you see how i mean look at look at my skin it just looks freaking good before i even put on the foundation so shout out to fenty skin it's been a month and i'm loving it if you haven't gotten it yet go get it if you haven't watched my fenty skin video i'm gonna link that and you should watch that too all right usually the first thing i would do is my eyebrows but they already look pretty decent so i'm not gonna bother to fill them in i'm just gonna clean them up so I have the Fenty Beauty Concealer in the shade 380. So let me do that first. I don't have eyeshadow primer, so the concealer, when I blend it out, is usually pretty good at doubling as a primer for my eyelids. All right. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with the brows now. Like they are not even cousins right now. They are neighbors maybe, but they're not related at all. living for how good my skin looks i don't have one foundation yet you guys <laughs> this is fenty skin and fenty primer and that's it 
All right, this is as good as the eyebrows are gonna get, so don't pay too much attention to that. Nextly, we're gonna do the eyeshadow. This palette doesn't have any like base colors. Well, I guess I could use this as a base color. Let's see, hold on. I told y'all I don't know how to do eyeshadow. Like my eyeshadow is very basic. I would just put something right here and go. Like all that cut crease and fancy stuff, smoky eye, I don't know how to do none of that. I really don't even know what I'm doing right now with this base color to be honest, but. Kind of thing, okay? I feel like I could've got a better base color though. Which color do I want to use? Now, this is giving me trophy wife vibes though. I like this. You know, I'm such an idiot. I'm here recording like this first color that I put on. And I just realized that the camera wasn't even going. So um, basically I was trying to decide which color I was gonna use and I ended up going with Time is Money. And I was saying that the color is pretty well pigmented. So that is a plus. Yeah, and I was just trying to figure out what should I do next? Cause usually like I would just put one color on my lid, some mascara, maybe eyelashes and call it a day. But I feel like I should like experiment. I just don't know what to do next. Like, what do I do? Um, so I'm gonna try, I'm gonna go in with this darker one and see what happens. I don't know where I'm putting it or what I'm doing with it, but. I don't know what's happening, but I'm making a wing. <laughs> Do my wings even match? Probably not. <laughs> Honestly, there is like helicopters flying all around my house. I'm hearing ambulances, police. I need to watch the news later and figure out what the heck is happening and why is this helicopter messing up my dang video. All right, we, we got something happening here. I don't know if it's, I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but something is happening. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I think that looks kind of cool. It looks editorial. Yeah? Yeah. And now I don't have to worry about doing a wing liner with a black liner because I'm really bad at that. I want to get this gold in here somewhere, so... Okay, right now this might look really psychotic, but I'm sure once I do like my whole face, it'll come together, I hope. <laughs> I actually look like a fool. <laughs> Yo, what am I even doing? I should have probably watched a video on how to do nice eyeshadow before I made this video. <laughs> Cause yo. Um, I think it looks cute. It's like sometimes I look at it and I'm like, okay, this is cute. And sometimes I'm like, girl, what the hell? Blend this out. Yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna get the Money Bank Green Fly Pen. Um, I think I'm gonna add this down to the bottom here. And I'm gonna clean up whatever this is with my concealer. Okay, <laughs> that looks kind of cool. Um, maybe I should put on my foundation. <laughs> um, for foundation, I have Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Hydrating Long Wear Foundation in the shade 385. I do also have the foundation brush, but I kind of like the Beauty Blender better, so I'm gonna use that. I 
love this foundation so much. It's just so like, it's like skin. It just, it doesn't, it's not too overbearing. It doesn't make me look or feel cakey. It just looks good and it blends in so good effortlessly. As you can see, my concealer is basically the same color as my foundation. <laughs> so it's not going to be a dramatic highlight because I'm not, I don't really like that because I'm very bad at blending things out. I use the same beauty blender that I use to put on my foundation. It's easier for me to blend that way. Okay, um, let's see, next I am going to use my Honey Pro Filter Translucent Powder to bake or set my um, concealer that I just put on. And again, I'm using my beauty blender. I literally use this for everything when I'm applying makeup. I have a, a couple of different beauty blenders and a couple of different brushes, but I always just end up doing this for the whole freaking process. First of all, this is the worst thing to use because it's hard to get it in the creases where I need it. So I really don't know why I'm using this. I'm just gonna leave that a little bit and I'm gonna rush it away. So for contouring, I'm gonna use this Anastasia um, contour kit that I bought literally years ago. Make a line, make a line. Um, I don't really like to contour my nose because my hand isn't that straight and then my nose be looking crooked, so I'm not even gonna bother. We're gonna do my forehead a little bit, blend that out. Wipe away whatever translucent powder that is. Be translucent. First of all, when I'm doing my makeup, I'm like chaotic and all over the place. Like, I don't really, I don't know what I'd be doing. I'd just be doing stuff, so. Now I'm gonna use the Fenty Beauty Mascara. This is what we've got so far with the mascara. I'm gonna still put on lashes because that just really makes the look pop. I think I am gonna do a bit of this cream blush. Super cute. All right, the lashes has been applied and with the Midnight Wasabi Mademoiselle Lipstick to complete the look. I think this is cute. I'm here for it. We are gonna finish up with the What It Do Makeup Refreshing Spray. I love this setting spray, refreshing spray, whatever. And there you have it. That is my finished look. <laughs> okay guys, let me know in the comments how I did. Again, I'm not much of a makeup girl. I kind of just like hope that the finished look comes together kind of okay to at least leave the house or post a picture. Um, I think this came out kind of cute. This is fun, different. I wouldn't necessarily wear this on a regular, obviously, but it's giving me bad vibes. It's giving me better have my money vibes, okay? Molala, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Better have my money Y'all should know